Hey, it's Chris with LG Squared, and I'm up at the High Performance Smurf House in Marietta, Georgia, that we are that we designed and are now building for a client. And it is a three-bedroom, two and a half bath structure. And we're calling it the Smurf House because of what you see. This is a very blue product. It is the weather resistive barrier that we uh, are putting on. This is equivalent to a house wrap. Uh, house wrap is something that has been used for a really long time, still continues to be used. Uh, there's a product, couple of products out there that have integrated that house wrap into the sheathing. And so it's a one step pro process. You just install the sheathing, tape the seams, and you've got your control layers. This is a product that is rolled on or sprayed on. It's liquid, liquid applied, or it is a liquid, and it is uh, it, it adheres to plywood, concrete, masonry, steel, and at the same time. So if you have steel and block next to each other, or steel and wood framing, it all it will it will adhere to both, and it will it and if they're right up against each other that'll span that that little gap there and hold itself together even if there's movement or expansion and contraction that happens this is a three-step process this one this is uh, made by polywall it's called their blue barrier system and the first step is to uh, detail everywhere around the building with their 2200 which is a uh, reinforced liquid uh, uh, membrane um, right here is where we're at that stage right here this is the 2200 and at this stage this is the detailing that I'm talking about once the detailing's done covering nail holes seams uh, all around the windows at, at where, where the seams are and other nail holes and these uh, corners are extremely important uh, once we have all the detailing done we wrap all the windows we're still at that stage. You see back here behind us. This is the uh, this is their 2400 product. You see it goes on at about a 40 mil thickness. That's bubbling up because of the temperatures, the sun beating down on it right now. But this is their flash and wrap system. Here, um, this is their 2400. Uh, it's it's thinner than the 2200, which is the stuff we use at the details. And then there's the stuff that goes in the field, and this is the 2300. Uh, this is our first coat. This was our first test coat here, and you can see the plywood. You can still see some of the plywood through it. So we're going to apply another coat to this, but we're going to do a longer video on this. But I wanted to just do a little quick sneak peek at where we're at today. We're about uh, about a quarter of the way through. Um, putting on our first coat here of the 2300. It's exciting. We're getting there. Uh, after the holidays, we'll be putting in our windows and then we'll button up all those details, do some air sealing, do our blower door test before rough in, and then we're going to go to town inside. But this is, this goes on. Once this is fully, totally on, all the windows are in, we've done all our air sealing, done our blower door tests, we're ready for rough in. We're also ready for insulation. Uh, insulation will happen right after we finish roughing, after we do our air sealing and do a blower door test. But then all the insulation, four inches on the walls, six inches on the roof, all to the exterior, that'll go on. Then we'll put our, we'll attach that with one by four furring strips and then we're ready for siding and metal roofing. More on all of this later. Thanks for checking in, but this has been Chris from the Smurf House, Smurf High Performance Smurf House in Marietta, Georgia. Uh, thanks for checking us out. We'll see you next time.